What's up everybody? This is a video I've wanted to do for a while, but uh, I just never really got around to doing. Um, I wanted to talk about something that I see people bring up quite a bit, and they always ask about with these trucks, and oh, is a catch can worth it, or should we put one on here, um, whatever, whatever. And uh, then you get the other people in there, oh, a catch can's not worth it, don't work, blah, 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 blah. Well, I want to address a couple of these things today in this here video. Um, the first thing that I want to address, mainly what this is about, is is why you can't put a catch can on these here uh, third generation Rams. And I'm not really sure what year this stopped or changed, so I can't tell you specifically what years this will or won't work on. Um, people know, I guess, and then there's some options, but I see a lot of people, they want to put a catch can right here, right on your oil filler neck. Right, right attached to your intake because they see you know they get they get oil down there on their on their filter and they say oh yeah you know it's uh, it's the bad PCV or what have you and things like that but the fact of the matter is if you're putting a catch can here it's in the wrong spot it's just completely in the wrong fucking spot um, this is an inlet side and a lot of people get this confused and I don't understand why or they don't understand how the PCV system works or how it works in these trucks but um, you know, you get the people that don't understand and they stick one there and they think it works because they get a little bit of oil and oh yeah, it did something. Or the people that think it doesn't work because they only got a little bit of oil. Um, but the, the worst have got to be the people that are living in denial. They stick a catch can there and, and then it's basically, oh yeah, wise guy, well uh, how come I'm catching oil then? It seems to be working just fine. Well, like I said, the problem is this is the suction side. This is where your ends and your PCV your, your, your crankcase gets clean filtered air coming in and it gets sucked through there. And how does it do that? How is it sucking in there? Because the PCV valve is right there. Right there. Inside the manifold. Inside everything. Not accessible. And this is the spot where you would want to put a catch can for it to actually work and catch significant amount of oil vapors. And if you're putting one here, all you're doing is catching fresh air. Except in the few times when your crankcase is going to have a positive pressure. And that's naturally going to force oil vapors out here. And they get into your filter. But we can show you that this is, this is suction. So just, just give me a second. So here's what's going on in the PCV valve hole. Um, and to the left you can see the hole that's connected to the throttle body. And that's uh, the throttle body and the intake manifold kind of thing. Um, that's what's sucking air in. That's that's sucking the air through the PCV system. Um, and this central hole right here, that's leading down into kind of like down into the valve cover sort of area, um, like down in there kind of thing. It's hard to see, I know, uh, but that's where. So that's where all your vapors are coming out of that big central hole and they're all getting sucked into that other hole on the side. All right, it's a little noisy, but we got the truck running and got this disconnected. Now look, if I put my finger over here, we give us a minute, this is suction and you'll hear it. But I don't know if you can hear that over the sound of the wind from the fans, but this is this is suction. This is sucking air in. So let's get that hooked back up here. So since you know I have no easy access to the crankcase that way, there's no way to stick a catch can there. And that's what they mean when they say these are internal. Because uh, this goes down down inside and in through the valve covers, I believe. Um, I think it I think it's like back there somewhere. It's internal, and that's where it's sucking all the fumes off of the crankcase. So, that's why you can't put a catch can on these um, without doing some special things. And I actually, I made a part, or I designed a part, but I can't really have it made. Um, but I'll also post a little bit of a picture of here. But I made this part to, uh, to be able to put a catch can on here. It's just, it needs to be investment cast to be made, and I don't know anywhere I can get that done, or anywhere that I can get it done cheaply, or reasonably priced, 
and it's not a high demand enough item that you know people are gonna want to be buying this off the shelf so why have 5,000 made as for whether or not catch cans work yes they do it's just basic science as long as you're installing them in the right place you've got hot oil vapors coming across into a cold can condensing and it works and it keeps your keeps your intake manifold and everything cleaner so you know for the for the disbelievers out there I'm, I'm sorry that you feel that way but they do work you just got to be able to put them in the right spot and right here on the oil filler neck is not the right spot so I hope this cleared some things up for some people if not let me know in the comments um, if you see anybody else talking about a catch can saying hey I put one here show them this video link them this video and show them why you can't put a catch can there and why it doesn't work or for why the deniers think oh it works you just don't catch very much because they've got it in the wrong spot and it's only a fraction of the time that the crankcase is at a high a positive pressure um, actually putting any pressure out through here so that being said share it around let people know that's why you can't do it on these third gens I don't know when they changed this and when it did become accessible I've been told that you can get um, I think you can put the 6.1 or the 6.4 valve covers on and, or intake manifold, sorry. Um, I think you can swap the intake manifold with the 6.1 or the 6.4 and it has an accessible spot for a catch can. But like I said, you, the, the point is you can't put one on here easily without modifying or doing a whole lot of work. So thanks for watching. I hope this cleared some stuff up. I'll see you guys around in the next video. Take it easy.